Girls, welcome to Circle Time with Miss Edna. Today we're going to sing a few songs and have a story. We're going to start with our welcome song. Are you ready? We're going to clap and clap, clap and clap. Hello to everyone and how are you today? We've come to our circle time to sing and laugh and play. And when we're up, we're up. And when we're down, we're down. But when we're only halfway up, we're neither up nor down. We'll roll our hands so slowly. Roll them very fast. Give your hands a clap, clap, clap. Lay them in your lap, tap, tap. One of the songs we're going to sing today is about our five little ducks. Our five little ducks, one with the feather on his back. And I don't know what happened, boys and girls, but my little duck here has lost his head. But we'll just pretend it's them. Five little ducks that I once knew. Fat ones, skinny ones, fair ones too. But the one little duck with the feather on his back. He led the others with a quack, quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. He led the others with a quack, quack, quack. Home from the river they did go. A wiggle wobble, wiggle wobble to and fro. But the one little duck, the feather on his back, he led the others with a quack, quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. He led the others with a quack, quack, quack. The next song we're going to sing is about our five little froggies. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five little froggies. Are you ready? Maybe you could crouch down and be a froggy too. Five little froggies sat on the shore. One went for a swim, then there were four. One, two, three, four. Four little froggies looking out to sea. One went for a swim, and then there were three. One, two, three. Three little froggies, what can we do? One jumped in the water, and then there were two. One, two. Two little froggies sat in the sun. One swam off. And then there was one. One little froggy. This is no fun. He dived in the red water. And then there were none. All the froggies have jumped off the log. Do you remember the song about our ears hanging low? We're going to be singing, Do Your Ears Hang Low? Stand up tall, get your ears ready to hang low. Do your ears hang low? Do they wobble to and fro? Can you tie them in a knot? Can you tie them in a bow? Can you throw them over your shoulder? Can you pluck a merry tune? Do your ears Hang low. Good job. Shall we do it a little bit faster? Okay. Do your ears hang low? Do the public to a bow? Can you tie them in a knot? Can you tie them in a bow? Can you throw them over your shoulder? Can you pluck a merry tune? Do your ears hang low? All right. One more time. We'll go really, really fast this time. Do your ears hang low? Do the public to a bow? Can you tie them in a knot? Can you tie them in a bow? Can you throw them over your shoulder? Can you pluck a merry tune? Ears hang low. Whew. That was really fast. All right, boys and girls. All right, boys and girls. We are going to have a story now called Do Your Ears Hang Low? Let's go. Today's story is called Do Your Ears Hang Low? Just like our song, it is sung by the Top Twins and pictures by Denny Cooper. I wonder if it's the same as our song we just sang. Do your ears hang low? Today, I'm going to read our 
asked a song. Do your ears hang low? Do they wobble to and fro? Can you tie them in a knot? Can you tie them in a bow? Can you throw them over your shoulders like a regimental soldier? Do your ears hang low? Mm, that's a little bit different than ours. Say, oh, llamas. And the mouse must be the one asking the questions. Do your ears stand high? Do they reach up to the sky? Do they droop when you are wet? Do they stiffen when they're dry? Can you semaphore your neighbor with a minimum of labor? Do your ears hang high? Look at those llamas. Their ears are hanging high. I think they're standing high. I don't think they can hang high. Do your ears flip-flop? Can you use them as a mop? Ooh, what animal is mouse talking to? A rabbit. You're right. Are they stringy at the bottom? Are they curly at the top? What do you think, boys and girls? I think so too. Can you use them for a swatter? Can you use them for a blotter? Do your ears flip flop? <laughs> Look at that mouse. He's getting flip flopped. Do your ears stick out? Could you waggle them all about? Can you flap them up and down? As you fly around the town? Can pigs fly? That's pretty silly. I don't think pigs can fly. Can you shut them up for sure when you hear an awful bore? Closing his ear, he doesn't want to listen. Hey kid, go check your look in the mirror. Check your look in the mirror. Do your ears hang low? Do your ears stick out? You got the cutest ears I've ever seen. page tells us some funny things about ears. Let's see what it says. Even when you're asleep, your ears continue to hear sounds, but your brain simply shuts them out. It says your ears give you a sense of balance. You may feel dizzy, if you have an ear infection, ooh, ear infections hurt, don't they? Hmm, now here's something important. Wearing headphones, those are the things we put over our ears so we can listen to music or maybe a movie. It says wearing headphones creates a great moist habitat for bugs. Ooh. In just an hour, the number of bacteria in your ears increases by 700 times Oh my goodness. So we don't want to keep them on for too long. I want to make sure they're clean before we use them too. The three bones in your ear are the smallest bones in your body and all three could fit together on a loony. Oh my goodness. That's all three of those bones could fit in that space. Cobras and snake charming acts are responding to the sight of the flute, not its sound. 
Have you ever seen a cobra in a basket and they play the song? Do, 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 And the snake coils up. Well, it's not because of the sound he's hearing. It's because he's seeing the flute. A cat has 32 muscles in its ear, and each ear can turn independently. Can your ears turn independently? I don't think so. I have to use my fingers to make my ears move. How about you? But a cat, he can move one ear this way and one ear this way. <laughs> Those are a few funny things about ears. Well, that was silly. And that is one of my favorite songs to sing. Do your ears hang low? Well, thanks for joining me for Circle Time, boys and girls. Now we'll sing our goodbye song. Are you ready? We take our little hands and clap, 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 clap. We take our little hands and clap, clap, clap. It's time to say goodbye. Now you can stand up or you can sit on your bottom and get your feet ready to stomp. We take our little feet and stomp, 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 stomp. Stomp, 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 we take our little feet. Stomp, 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 it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, boys and girls. Thank you for joining me today.